Good afternoon YouTube, welcome back to our Chinese playthrough. We have taken on Poland and we have won. We are gathering the navy around Korea. Um, I think that's our next, well, our next step anyway, is to try and take down Korea, who so far have been running away with this game really. Korea are doing very, very well. But you can't really take that too much to heart with Korea. The Korea are always, always going to have a ridiculously strong science game. And you can see here, literacy wise, we are definitely behind but still in fourth we're not doing too badly so i'm not too worried what we've what we've done is we've sort of science focused everywhere we've got public schools being built we're just about to unlock research labs i i'm all i'm just i'm confident that we'll be able to catch back up career but we must continue to try now we can steal a tech let's just do this quickly archaeology is the only one that we can steal but it it all helps you know, it all it all helps us get us there. So let's just quickly get this. Is it going to let us? Yeah, there we go. Um, that actually puts us well onto the way for oil, actually, which is quite good. Um, oh, God, we're going to have about 101 antiquity sites, unfortunately, because we've got such a big empire. But never mind. Um, oh, yeah, our agent got um, expanded. That's fine. Um, do, 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 do. Now, if you remember, we are attacking Siam, and our artillery unfortunately has been killed by cavalry, which isn't great. Um, but we can we can fire back and we can push this guy away. So let's just move everything forward a little bit. Um, hang on, you can see this artillery here is a little bit injured. You moved here. Thank you very much. Uh, let's. Okay, I'm just trying to think about how to do this. Okay, right, I think if we if we just do this sort of logically, so we bring the back artillery forward like so. Keep this guy coming round. You wait there for a second. And artillery, you move to there. You move to here. Wonderful. Now these guys are, are within range and they are going to just bombard the cavalry here. Just to make sure these guys are not going to pick on me and destroy him a little bit later. I don't want to lose any more artillery. Artillery is, is brilliantly powerful and upgraded. We don't want to lose any more than we have to. Um, this Gatlin gun can fire only the once. So yeah, that was the rubbish one, wasn't it? Oh man! Now I remember. Okay, fair enough. Um, there we go. So, we are only at war with Siam at this precise moment, I believe. Um, we're at war with a lot of city-states, but those are unfortunately all of Siam's allies, so we're going to have to just kill Siam for that. Um, it may be that we only take the capital and rest there. Let's just have a quick look and see what we're going to win from Siam if we do beat them. Um, wonder-wise, let's have a quick look. None. No wonders at all. Fair enough. Fair enough. That's a shame, but, you know, we can live with that if we need to. Um, I'm just sort of checking my religion actually. It is spreading across slowly. Um, okay, right, production, factories are being finished. That's all good news indeed. Let's just pop a bank up. Uh, Ivan the Terrible, everyone just move forward. So many generals, there's no need to have this many generals. I might have to pop them down as a, as a um, you know, unique improvement at some point. Right, these guys, I'm just going to wait my frigates here for now. I need to wait for support. Four frigates aren't going to be enough to take down uh, a 63 rank city, unfortunately. Um, which is a shame, but there we go. Now, this frigate is just on the lookout for Siamese navies, but I can bomb an archaeologist if I want. That gets me experience. Uh, cavalry, let's make land. Uh, let's keep going around, actually. We want to get onto this bit. Here. Here. Um, okay, where else needs to move? Privateer. Ah, we've got a privateer near as well now. That's awesome. All coming into range of Korea. Korea has denounced the Incans. Yeah, what are the Incans? I oh, I guess the Incans are sort of neighbours of Korea, aren't they? I'm surprised Korea and Portugal have gone to war. Korea is normally not a very big warmonger, as far as I'm aware. I could be completely wrong on that one. Um, but who knows? Lisbon still seems to be relatively safe, but Porto is blockaded. The Celts have adopted the order ideology. Yay! We've actually got someone else on board. That's awesome. That's really awesome. Oh, my caravel has been bombarded by Gatling guns. Blimey. That seems rather harsh. 
Um, let's just take a look at the ideologies quickly. If you remember, we're the pretty much the only people that aren't going autocracy. Autocracy is definitely the favourite one to go for, but now that the Celts are on side, look at that, we're finally getting a little bit of influence towards order. So I'm happy with that. That's nice. That is good. Okay. Dissidents. Preferred ideology is order. So actually, maybe... Ah, oh, the Celts coming in are actually quite good. Okay, wonderful. Maybe we can get a few more people on side for order. We'll see. Um, right. Rawclaw. Okay, this is one of the Polish cities that we took. This should be able to hold fairly easily against um, any Siamese counterattack, but I'm just going to move my troops across just in case. Okay. I want to keep them garrisoned while we can. Ah, this Gatling gun is pretty, pretty dead. So, back you come. Uh, Great War Inventory, you can stand here. Thank you very much. Uh, you, Mr. Artillery, need to heal up, please. Um, and the rest of my artillery need to start making their way forward, really. Um, look at that. That's an amazing amount of bonus here. So, our Great War Inventory should be exactly the same. But because of my upgrades and because of my Great General... I'm attacking with a lot more strength. Bam. Look at that. It's a nice attack. Um, okay, so as we have said previously, we are moving the cities, or moving our artillery closer, so that we're within a range of three. Um, as so, now let's just keep moving these guys forward. Okay, one, two. I've got at least three in range now, but that's not enough. We need more. Let's bring you guys forward. Um, Mr. You need to come forward as well. This guy, I'm just going to use him just to shoot the artillery quickly. May as well get this one to do the same, like so. Uh, my great people are just going to move across a little bit. That's a little to do. Okay, wonderful. Right. Uh, public school. Get it sorted. You too, public school. Artillery. We've got spare artillery now. Um, I might need you in Krakow, actually. Off you go. I'm terrible. Hey, you're all alone, aren't you? Right. Stack you up there. Frigates, again, just wait off the coast. Caravel, this is the one that was attacked by the Gatling gun. Oh, look at that. Oh dear, these cavalry are going to lose out if I attack against this uh, Great War Inventory here. You continue to heal up. I might need more troops down here, actually. I've got a pretty good Gatling gun, so I'll move that Gatling gun here. This one, if you remember, the one that was sort of Guarding Barcelona is the Gatling gun that has two range. So let's just bring that down. And this caravel. Ooh. God, you've gone a long way to get there. Never mind. Just continue to explore. Thank you. Wallenstein, you wait there. Frigate. Anything else that I can see? No? Oh, hang on. I don't know why I did that. No, it doesn't look like Songhai is any more navy, really. Songhai? Siam. Who am I talking about? God, who knows. Um, and then I'll set this guy up. Wonderful. Privateer. Again, just head this way. Cavalry. There you go. Made land. Fantastic. Okay, the Incans. What are you guys up to these days? The Incans are normally pretty strong, actually. They normally get a very good production base because of all of the... Um... I mean, they've put mines up here, which is weird but normally they can stick um what are they called terrace farms on hills which is pretty good that, that seems like a terrible deal Paul, but, um Celts I'm not gonna lie right seven no, they're not gonna give me a sensible deal I don't think so never mind hopefully the Celts are going to come on board actually if the Celts come on board um because of the fact that we're all order these days then that would be awesome um, they can start to give me quite decent trades in comparison. Let's just see, is it worth moving my artillery round before firing? I've got three in range. Uh, this one is set up. Let's just see how much damage it'll do. 39 damage. Okay, it's not great. Not great. I may as well just keep moving round for now. Right, let's do that. Move you to here. This great war inventory. I'm just going to bring you backwards to here. Thank you. Uh, actually, you can upgrade to regular inventory now. Awesome. OK, 
again. Artillery, you just come forwards for me. Great people do the same. These artillery can move forward as well. You attack that. Gatlin gun. No, you can't range. Never mind. Um, okay, now we've got plastics. That's really good. It means we can start to build some research labs up and we desperately do need research labs. Um, the next thing we need is battleships. Let's just do that quickly. Um, oh no, biology first so we can see the oil. Then refrigeration because we'll need to, you know, normally they're all up on offshore platforms and then electronics after that. Let's do that. Um, as I say, if you remember, we, we're going to take one of these cities with our frigates and then use the territory to upgrade to battleships. That's why we're saving money at the moment. I say saving money, we're actually losing money at the moment, but we should pick up money faster than we lose it through, um, uh, what do you call it, um, through killing people with honour. And you can see here, here's my frigate army. They're going to take a few turns to get there. Um, but we should have all the requisite techs we need by that point, so I'm not worried. Public school. Awesome. Okay. Research labs. Cool. Just keep building them. Everything sciencey possible. I have a terrible. I'm just going to get you guys to sleep. Artillery. Um, you're set up, so I'm just going to make you fire on that rifleman there. Thank you. Just for extra experience. Frigate. Um, may as well just come back down here for now. Privateer, you go to there as well. You wait. Ironclad. Ooh. Awesome. Right, I needed you to come through here, didn't I? Through you come. Cavalry. Okay, I'm just going to rest this guy on this hill here, just so hopefully I can... Okay, so from this, uh, from next turn on, I'm going to move my cavalry in, get the line of sight with um, the city, and then move him back so he's out of range. That seems like a good idea. Right. Let's just rest that. Awesome. Frigate. Um, no, to be honest, you just wait there for now. Awesome. Okay, so next turn we can open fire on the Siamese capital. Once we've taken that, we might be able to just declare peace with them, actually. There's no point... Um, fighting Siam too hard, really. Oh, look at that. Someone actually shot our artillery. Oh, man. Terrible. Oh, here we go. Here's the Siamese army. Now, if you remember the cannons, cannons are priority because these guys can do a lot of damage. I, if I lose this place, I'm not going to be too annoyed. It's just a puppeted Polish state. It's not getting me too much. Um... So I'm not overly fast, but let's just quickly take a shot at the cannons. Oh, wow. Okay, lots of damage. Um, and my Gatling guns are fairly decent as well. Um, oh, barbarian attacks down here, I tell you. Let's just get rid of this Gatling gun here. This is the one most likely to do damage to me. Bang, double hitting Gatling guns. It's all good. Public school. Research lab. Oh, are you going to give me something else to do? Here we go. Um, and you can attack here again, double hitting Gatling guns. Right, and as I said, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to move my cavalry in one. Now I've got range sight, which is good. And then we are going to fire on the capital, like so. Set up, fire. Set up, fire. Uh, set up fire like that. Awesome. These artillery can just keep coming around. Um, move my cavalry back just so that they can't get shot by the city. Uh, these guys may as well just shoot over here. Which one's worth it? Let's tap those ones. Awesome. And then the great generals just go to sleep. There's nothing I can really get you to do at the moment. You wait there. Um, nothing for you to shoot, so you just set up an alert. When Siam bring their army back down, there'll be more to shoot in this direction. And then the inventory, you can rest up. You alert. You fall asleep. There we go. Right. From next turn onwards, there should be less movement to do, which should be good. And we press ahead. Awesome. 
it'll be interesting to see if we can actually take Korea on. Korea are so so techy ahead. I'm just aware that they're going to be able to, to bomb us with planes from quite a distance. Um, they, oh, they're going to offer me a city? No. Not just yet. I want to take your capital, sir. And then you can offer me a city. Um, yeah, once we get into the, the Korean heartland here, you can see they kind of own, own the bay. It should be pretty easy to hit Seoul once we have got a foothold, but we'll need to build airplanes and everything here. So, um, yeah, never mind. Uh, Madrid. These are the barbarians, I think, weren't they? Yeah, here we go. The Great War Inventory. Right. Die. Die, Great War Inventory. Like so. And the cavalry can come and just take them on, finish them off. Awesome. 50 gold, 50 culture. It's not bad, is it? Wow, here's the Siamese army. I wondered where they were. Um, okay. Right, we're going to put this artillery here. I think. So, right. Let's just do this logically. We'll move in. Artillery, fire onto the city. We're just going to hit those two there because we know those two can only shoot at that city. Now, this Gatling gun, I'm going to take these guys on with these artillery because these can't hit the capital city. The others, though, I might, I might, yeah, divert one or two of the artillery hits to here. Here we go. Like that. Um, simply because I don't want my artillery to die. Let's just finish off those cannons. Get these Gatling guns to hit twice as well. Oh, here we go. Extra range as well. Got double range now. Awesome. Um, and then these artillery again. I'm just going to hit the cavalry as they're fastest. And then move our cavalry back to safety here. You wait that. Splendid. Research lab. Wonderful. Building all of the research buildings now. I'm just going to move this artillery up north, as is this one as well. Get these guys to come and help the defence. Cargo ship. Awesome. Now let's just see which uh, which trade routes are the most profitable for me at the moment. Trade routes available. See if it's still Hanoi is my most beneficial one. Um, Hanoi has most of them, doesn't it? All right, cool. Right, go to Hanoi. Uh, there we go. Thank you. Uh, these guys... Inventory. Actually, I'm going to move these inventory to the edge here. Now, this, these guys are going to be more than tough enough to keep most of the units back. But especially near the Great General, if they attack us, they are going to regret it. We're better in open terrain, but at least we've got the bonus from the hill. So it's not like we're losing out by standing on a hill. Um, Can you give us a deal? Hang on. If I give you three of them, will you give me 15 gold per turn? No, nope. hang on, fine. Just need some gold per turn. Give me 12 gold per turn. Fine, go away. If you're not going to give me a sensible deal, I'm not going to trade with you. So there. There we go. So they did start to attack the artillery as we feared they might, but at least I've got an inventory here now, which is stopping them from... Moving too close. Ah, another cannon here. And some artillery over there. So this is where the Siamese army were. They were clearly off fighting somewhere at the time. Um, oh, we've got some oil. We've actually got oil. Wonderful. Right, go and kill these guys. And then these riflemen are the only people that my Gatling guns can shoot. So that is who they will shoot. You set up and fire again. Awesome. Those guys are down. Um, let's have a quick look. Now, let's just move the cavalry back in. And again, we will shoot with these artillery. See if we can take down Siamese's, the Siamese capital. Oh, I want to keep that guy alive, so the capital has to go down this turn. Um, one more, I think. Like so, and then bang, Zaz. 
Right. Let's view the city, see what it's got for us. A bank. Uh, no research buildings there. That's a bit unfortunate. Never mind. I have to puppet it to capital. Um, okay, that artillery should be able to heal up nicely now. Um, we can fight the Siamese, do some damage to them. Let's just polish up that rifle there. Hit this one. Oh, hello. Barrage, and then hit this one. And then our inventory can go and finish off. Oh, no. No, 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 no. We don't want to go to war with uh, America. Actually, sorry, I should have just had a look. Oil. So we've got four oil off the coast. Where was our other oil? God, again, look. We've got so much territory. And no oil at all. This oil is in Genoan land. We're getting that one. And then we've got one off here. Four off there. Some off here. Oh, a ton of oil down here though. Three. Three. Okay. Okay, so we didn't get much oil. That is that is bad. We needed a lot of oil. <laughs> we did need a lot of oil. Um, we can't steal from the Celts. Oh, we're second on literacy. We're catching up with Korea. Um, can't steal from the Celts. Who are we going to steal from them? Oh, God. These guys are taking forever to steal from America. I um, have to move to Seoul then. Although the potential is not very good. Let's try. Let's try as a spy. Um, da -da -da -da. Move again to... Portugal as a spy. Awesome. We're not going to steal anything this probably, but it's always worth a try. Research labs. In we come. Just keep building them for me. Cargo ship. Let's just get the most profitable route that I can get. 18 gold for America. Let's do it. Captain Gun. Uh, you wait there. You heal up quickly. Thank you. Ironclads, I need you just down here. As soon as you can. Thank you. Awesome. Okay. Oh, well, there's an inventory now down here. Hopefully we're not going to miss our, our chance to attack Korea, but we will see. Now, Siam are probably going to attack me a little bit. There we go. Yep, yeah, like so. Bodicea has declared war on Shaka. I'm surprised Shaka is still alive, actually. Where is their capital? Here. Okay. Doing okay. Not too bad at all. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend a turn just killing Siamese units, and then I will ask them for peace. But I'll do that next episode. Thank you very much. Next time, hopefully, we can get the navy. We can push through the turns. We'll have a few turns of peace um, just while we can. Um, we will push forward uh, and see if we can get our navy to Korea. And we'll see if we can go to war there. But until then, thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you in a bit. Bye.